What's up guys, Jacob Pritchard here. Quick tip for the EOS 5D Mark IV and the Wi-Fi settings. Uh, if you switch the functionality uh, to transfer only the JPEG, it will speed things up a ton. Uh, I think it's something that really could potentially uh, change the game for me in terms of how I work on set. Uh, so first, I just want to show you really quickly, I have, um, this is actually a MacBook Air, uh, so that's another interesting point. If you're using the JPEGs, you don't need as much processing power, so you can use a slightly slower computer. I'm excited to be able to use the MacBook Air, uh, something we can kind of shoot a little bit more run and gun with, uh, and also it has a little bit better battery power. Um, but I just, you know, I'm going to show you guys here just how quickly kind of these transfers can take place. And there we go. So it's not instantaneous, but it is pretty darn quick. Um, we are still saving the raw file onto the card in the camera. Uh, but if you work in a way uh, where you're on a set, you have a client, other creatives uh, who need to be able to see what you're doing, uh, that can be a really great way to get it over. Uh, so I'm just going to jump right in and show you how it's done. Here we are on my MacBook Air screen. I have the uh, EOS 5D Mark IV already connected. Uh, I've got the latest version of EOS Utility. Here is where you are going to go. Click there and where it says computer and camera memory card, make sure that's checked. And then of course, check off this box that says in raw and JPEG mode, only transfer JPEGs to the computer. Um, of course, you also want to make sure that you are capturing on your camera in RAW and JPEG mode for this to work. Uh, and then the final thing you're going to do is you're going to go to Other Functions, Quick Preview. That is going to pop up this window uh, that shows kind of what you immediately saw. I'm going to snap a couple more off just so that uh, something pops in there for you to see. Um, the JPEGs are, of course, still being downloaded uh, onto the computer, so you could use Bridge, Photo Mechanic, Finder, anything you want to kind of preview through everything. Uh, but this is going to be uh, the quickest way to just get a real immediate look at the photos you're shooting. Uh, so that's it. Uh, try to keep it short and to the point, but I think this is a really cool feature of this new camera. Uh, please let me know what you think. Please let me know, too, if you have any other questions about the 5D Mark IV. Love to answer uh, any questions people have and see how I can help you guys out.